Hello my little screwballs, what is up? It is Screwball, and I know what you're thinking, OMG, three videos in one week, impossible. Well, um, don't get used to it. It's just because I've been on quarantine since last Friday, and I've had, uh, ideas, because you know I wanted to do that part two for some time. And, um, the short film was because my cat died, so that wasn't really planned. Uh, but yeah, so today I have a video title suggests I got some new Shiklet horses, and I'm going to be showing them now. This part of the video right here, this first half, um, I, uh, got three horses today, uh, but the store I went to, they didn't really have a whole lot of new horses or ones that I wanted to get, because there were two horses I had in mind that I wanted to get, uh, a quarter horse mare, I think. I don't know. There were a couple mares I wanted to get, and maybe some more foals, because I don't have a whole lot of foals. Uh, or colts, at least. I have like three fillies, but anyways, I wanted to get some more horses, but I'm gonna have to wait till tomorrow afternoon when we run over to another town that's like 20 minutes away, so yeah, there's gonna be like an awkward jump cut in this video to tomorrow, so let's just start with the ones we got today. So, so, we gotta start with our little foal that I got today. So we got this little pinto foal. Um, I don't know if you can see it, but it's a boy. It's a cute little pinto foal. And by the way, I did not plan on getting any of the horses I got today. It's just I walked in and saw them and was like, oh, they're so pretty, I want them. So, uh, let's see if I can get a little close up of them. Very, very cute. And to go with that, I got a pinto mare. She is also very pretty. She is quite small compared to my other horses. Like, hang on, I have my horses right here. I keep my horses separate from the other animals because I have so many of them. Like, this is my Tennessee Walker mare, and this is her. And she's a little smaller than her, but she's still a pretty small horse. Or either I have a lot of big horse breeds. So, uh, yeah. There she is. And then I got this horse. Now, I didn't really look at her size when I got her, but she is a pretty big horse. We got an American Saddlebred. I think that's what she is. Uh, an American Saddlebred. Mm -hmm. Um, mare. And she is a really big horse. Like, height and length wise, not weight wise, but she's a big horse. Like, hang on. Um, let me find her real quick. Okay, so my biggest horse is my Clydesdale Stallion. You know, the one I did a video on a while back. So here he is. And here she is. So let me go and put her behind him so that y'all can see just how big she is. Yeah, she's a pretty big horse. And I gave them all names, but I'm going to do a name reveal at the end of this video. So I'm going to go take their tags off, uh, give them their bath, I'm not going to film that, and uh, I will see you in the second part tomorrow when I get more horses. Boom, just like that, it is the next day. So, um, here's the thing. I was actually kind of looking for these two horses, this mare and this foal, but I couldn't find them at the other store, but I did find a different horse that I was looking for, and she's real pretty. But then we went back to the store we went to yesterday, and I got a little animal that's not a horse, and I got a very special treat from there for us, so, uh, yeah. Okay, so let's start with the two I got from the one store. So, the first one I got was this, oh she can't stand, this quarter horse mare. I don't know why she's not standing, I see why she's not standing, but I don't know why she's not standing. So I guess I'll have to hold her while I show you her. 
very pretty quarter horse mare. I don't know what the deal is with her legs right here. I'm pretty <laughs> sure she was standing. I mean, there were other quarter horses at the store that were standing up just fine, so she should be standing up. I don't know. Mm -hmm. We'll prop her up over here to the side. See if maybe one of her legs is bent or something. But anyways, <clears throat> next we have an Arabian mare. This beautiful Arabian mare. And I was actually thinking about getting her for a while. But I didn't, you know, ever get her. But now I have her. Very pretty. She got her mane done. With little pink beads, I guess, in it. Okay, but let's just try and... I'm just trying to figure out what the situation over here with this horse is. Because, like, this sh she should be able to stand. Like, I stood her up in the car and she was standing up just fine. I don't know what's going on here. Is she supposed to lean on that leg like that? Because I stood her up on the dashboard in the car and she was standing just fine. Maybe it's a whole balancing act. Maybe I just got extremely lucky when I was balancing her in the car. Okay, anyways. So next we're going to go on to the animal that I got that wasn't a horse. And it was this little piglet. Because if you remember, I have a pig and I've been thinking about getting a little piglet for a while. Just a little, small little $3 one or something like that. Very cute. Alright, and now time for the treat I was talking about. And so the treat for the that I got was a Speck blind bag. It's a Farm World blind bag, and this is actually my first Speck blind bag ever. So it says up here two to three animals included. So let us see if there's a tear strip, but I don't see one, and I don't know if I have a pair of scissors in here. I think we can open it from the top up here, so let's open it. Okay, I can. Okay, I'm gonna run over here real quick and see if I have a pair of scissors. Because I usually have a pair of scissors on my desk somewhere. Like, I don't understand what happened to my two pairs of scissors. I know where one of them is. Because I usually have two pairs, actually. A pink and purple pair and a blue pair. They're like little kid scissors, you know, like you get for kindergarten and stuff. But, like, I can't open it. So, instead, let's just look at the ones you can get in here. So, there are full-size horses. There are puppies and lambs, and there's a donkey, a chicken, cows. So yeah, I don't know why it doesn't have a tear strip on it. That'd be very helpful. So I'm gonna have to go run and get some scissors. I'll be right. Okay, I'm back, and I brought the scissors. So now we can get to opening. Okay, got a little opening right there. And now let's see what's in this bad boy. Oh, it's a little doggy. It's a very little doggy. It's so cute. And uh, a horse. It's a very, it's a brown horse with a tan mane. I can see that. So let's get these bad boys open. I'm just gonna, well, you didn't see it, but I stick a little bit on the top. Uh oh, its ears pierced through the bag. Come on, there we go. Alright, it's got some cardboard in between its legs, which I might actually use for some crafting. And it's got a tag on its leg, just like any other Schleck would. So here we have it, and it's a boy. But you know, I didn't get any stallions, so sorry I covered the camera. It's just I have it set up different than I usually do. So here he is. I don't know what kind of horse he is, but I will include it at the end. 
when I give when I tell you all my horses' names because I know all my horses. Are there. And there we got this little puppy dog. Now it's a very it's like the size of a dash hound, but it looks like a golden retriever. And he's so cute. Or she. I don't know. That's a cute little doggy. I was hoping I would get a horse and a dog. Because, you know, I saw that there were horses in the blind bag. And it was the last one of that series that was at the store. They have more blind bags, but they didn't have horses in them. So I wanted to get that one. But look at him. He's gorgeous. And a little puppy dog, too. It's so cute. I love that so much. I'm going to see if it says somewhere on the back what kind of horses they are. Okay, so it does not, which is kind of sad, but the ones I got were that dog right there and that horse right there, the one on the very end. I was kind of hoping for um, either this white horse, this black horse, or this brown horse right here, but you know, he's pretty. He's cute. I like him. I don't know if it has a checklist or anything that tells you, but I'll look up what breed it is and include it at the end when I tell you all my horse names, because, like I said, I name all my horses, but I don't name other animals like that. So, uh, yeah. So, let me just finish off the video here, and then we'll get to the horse Okay, names. guys, well, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, remember to leave a thumbs up, and if you're new here and you liked my video, and you think you'd like my content, then please consider subscribing and becoming a screwball like the rest of us. And I will see you next time, my pretties. Bye! Mm -hmm.